Hey guys, it's Crystal. Um, it's been about, I think, two weeks since I've done my last video. Um, my last video was the one where I did the ovulation test. And um, I just wanted to come and tell you guys about how I've been feeling. I took a pregnancy test this morning and it came out negative. Now, I'm not supposed to start my um, period until the 3rd and today's October 1st. So I still have two more days. But really, I mean, come on. If I was pregnant by now, my test would reflect that I was pregnant. It wouldn't be negative. So I'm counting this month out as a bust. Now... Because of that, I'm not going to lie. This time, I'm really I'm really down about it. I mean, not necessarily down. Like, I'm still in a good mood. I'm just a little disappointed because I like things to work. I'm real pragmatic. I'm a realist. I'm not, I'm not an optimist, you know. I'm not one of those people who, you know, who gets encouragement, takes it, and believes it. Like... When somebody tells me, oh, you know, it's okay, don't worry about it, or it'll happen all in God's time, which I do believe it will, I accept that, but I also accept, accept the realities of life, and the realities of it are, is that, unlike most of you women, I've never had a positive um, pregnancy test before, ever. I've never had a chemical pregnancy, I've never had a miscarriage, I've never in my life had a positive test result. So that tells that tells me a lot. And I'm starting to just accept the fact that maybe I'm not meant to be a mother. Maybe I'm not supposed to have a child. I mean, my friend just, um, we were just talking about going on a cruise next year. And she was like, oh, but what if you're pregnant? And then I started thinking, you know what? Do I even really want a child right now? I mean, I won't be able to go on that cruise next year if I'm pregnant. Or I won't want to go on the cruise if I'm pregnant. You know, and, and it's like I still have not selfish thoughts, but, you know, I need to make sure that I'm really ready to bring a child into the world and that I'm just not doing this because I'll be 30 this year or because people keep telling me that I need to have a baby. Like, I really need to make sure that this is what I want to do. So, right now, I don't think it's my timing, and I, I honestly don't think it's God's timing. I just don't think that it's meant for me to have a child right now. So, I'm going to stop actively trying. I mean, if it happens, great, but I'm just tired of putting myself through buying these tests, you know, finding out I'm ovulating, doing the two-week wait. I'm just not... I'm just not into that. I guess I'm just, I don't have patience, and that's something that I need to work on. Um, so besides all of that, me blah, 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 and me ranting about that kind of stuff, I do have some good news. I got a permanent teaching job. Yay! Um, I am the school's uh, permanent journalism teacher, so I've been busy with that. The kids are great. It's been a lot of fun. Let's see what else is going on in my world. Still living, having fun, you know, being crystal. And I guess I'll talk to you guys later. I'll still follow you guys. I'll still be praying for you guys' big fat positives. And I'll keep track of everything that, that you guys post. I love seeing y'all's videos to the people that I'm subscribed to. Well, it's been real. And I will guess I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.